My name is Serene. I'm 15 years old and I live in London. I actually found out later on that they stood up. Uh, they gave me a standing ovation, which was an absolute shock to me because I didn't I didn't expect any of that. I didn't know that they were standing up, but um, my, my, my parents told me and I was like, oh my gosh, seriously? takes you home one more time I promise after that I let you go I have a rare condition called optic nerve atrophy whereby my nerve just slowly, de slowly deteriorated over the years it was just on a annual basis that we saw deterioration of her vision then around the age of seven, eight, she started losing it very fast and within two years she lost it all. I used to sing a lot to my late grandmother uh, and she gave me a lot of confidence to continue. So um, I started singing more and more, even though I was <laughs> horrendous. Um, and then I started like songwriting at around seven or six about childish things like best friends um, and princesses. And then when I lost my sight, I kind of felt like I couldn't do as much. I used to be very sporty, like I used to do a lot of sports and dancing, and I just found that quite difficult. So by the time I was 10 or 11, I started to take music more seriously. And that's when I really discovered my passion and love for music. Like me. The whole journey has been a challenge in a way, but I've managed to um, to change that into opportunities. For example, I've had to learn how to live as a person who can't see, um, going from like learning braille to just generally doing things without any sight. And I want people to understand that no matter what you face in life, you can still uh, change, turn that into opportunities. And you sang beautifully. On the day, she was very nervous and, you know, I looked out and I saw, you know, 3,000 people and I really didn't know what was going on because I've only ever seen her sing in front of a few people, you know, in, at home or at school. I don't know if I'm in the final yet, but Let's see. And honestly, I don't think I mind if I don't get through because so far the journey's been incredible um, and it's been an amazing experience. I'll be performing at the Graham Layton Trust. It's a charity um, that treats people in Pakistan with sight loss. I do listen to a lot of Urdu songs, but I can't sing it because I can't speak Urdu, but I'd love to learn. I do listen to like Vital Signs. Um, um, because obviously, Jan because of Jeanette Uncle. I have visited Pakistan um, and I'd love to in the future pretty soon. Hopefully when lockdown is over, I'd like to uh, visit Pakistan and just meet people, all the people that have given me, have shown me so much love and support.